Hey guys, what's up? It's Caitlin here and honestly, I am really excited for this video today because it's very different and it's gonna be a lot of fun for me. So I hope it's a lot of fun for you guys too. But before we actually get into anything, I have a little request for you guys if you don't mind. So as you can see, I'm wearing my Dunder Mifflin shirt here. And if you guys remember, I actually made a My Strange Addiction to the Office video about two months ago. And my goal with that video is to get somebody, at least one person from the office to see it, to recognize it because that would just I would die. So what I'm gonna ask you guys to do, if you don't mind, is to head on over to Twitter and tweet the link to that video out, tagging at the Office NBC and as many Office cast members as you can possibly find on Twitter, as well as me at Caterpillar underscore underscore. If you guys tag me in it, I will be sure to retweet you, and I will go ahead and put the link to that video right up there in the little eye. Yeah, so you guys can grab it there. And I don't know if you guys could help me get the Office to recognize that. Video video to see it, it would mean the world to me. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. So I don't know really what sparked this. I don't know why I thought this was going to be a good idea, but I did, so I'm doing it. I don't know. So what I'm going to do today, guys, is I'm going to try and draw the Criminal Minds cast with my eyes closed. I want you to, to know that I have no artistic ability. Like, honestly, I cannot draw to save my life. So this, even if my eyes were open, like, it would be a disaster. So with my eyes closed, this should be really, really interesting. And I'm actually going to do the cast from season four, so kind of that main crew or whatever. So I'm gonna do all seven of those main characters. And if you guys end up liking this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and let me know in the comments so I can make another one doing other characters from more recent seasons, including like Aaron Strauss and Jason Gideon. Like, you guys let me know, it's all up to you guys what you wanna see. So let's try and draw some Criminal Minds characters with my eyes closed, oh my god. So my plan here is to tape a sheet of paper to my makeshift easel. I made it with pillows and the lid of a container, so obviously it's gonna be great. All right, so I'm gonna start with Hotch just because I think, I don't know, I feel like that makes sense, but I don't know, guys. I'm gonna close my eyes now and I'm gonna try to draw Aaron Hotch there. I think the defining characteristic that I'm gonna give Hotch is a tie. Eyes are closed. Okay, so if this is the top. Oh God, this is already harder than I thought and all I've drawn is a head. Okay, so this is Hotch. And this is his hair. That's Hodge, right? Right? You know it. Why did I take my hand off? Now I don't know where I just drew. Oh my god. Wait. This is the top in the middle. So I probably drew it around here. Right, guys? So I'll give him some eyes. I'm not going to be super detailed with the face because I already know. It's his nose. And he's like always a little... He doesn't really smile, so I'm going to give him one of those. How are we doing? Are we doing good? I'm not going to draw stick people. I'm going to try and draw like legit... Okay, so that's like his suit top, and it would have like, it's like the opening to his suit. Wearing a tie, obviously. This is his tie. That's his tie. Now he needs pants. How's it looking, guys? This is the bottom of the paper, and his shoes probably go there. Oh shoot, he needs hands. Crap, I forgot to draw the hands when I was drawing this suit. <laughs> okay. How's it looking? So ear, ear, right? I think for the background on this one, I'm just gonna draw the jet because I always think of like Hotch most associated with the jet because like wheels up in 30. So like maybe I'll just draw a little jet. That's the jet. The fact that you guys know what this looks like and I have zero idea is terrifying to me. Okay, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna look at it yet. How did I do? Did I do a good? All right, I'm gonna look at it now. This is very much not what I was expecting. I think if all of these things were in the right place, it actually would probably look pretty decent. This is Aaron Hotchner. For some reason, I felt like I was drawing a lot bigger than I was. That's his hand, by the way. This is his face, very much disconnected. What is that? Oh, it's his ear. The jet looks cute. Well, that's Aaron Hotchner. So, yup. Who should I do next, guys? I think I'm gonna do, ooh, I'm gonna do Prentice next. Oh, I'll draw Sergio. I'm gonna draw Sergio with Prentice. Are we ready to draw Emily Prentice? I'm not. I'm gonna try and do better this time. Eyes are closed. Okay, so this is Emily's head. And she's got beautiful hair. So, I'm gonna draw 
her body. Oh, what did I just do? That didn't feel right. This is probably about where her hand would be. So I'm gonna draw some pants and some shoes. So now I wanna draw Sergio. That's my cat. All right guys, so we're gonna see what Emily Brundis looks like right now. Okay, um, better. So here she is. This is um, Emily Prentice. Look at the cat. The cat actually looks kind of good if you ask me. I don't know how I messed this up that bad. I literally didn't take my pen off the paper when I drew the hair and the head, but somehow I managed to just do a horrible job. Every time I do this, I feel like I'm drawing a lot closer to the top than I am, which is really weird. This is Emily Prentice, and I think she looks fantabulous. Who is next, guys? Let's draw Morgan. What should Derek? What should I draw for Derek Morgan? I'm gonna give. Derek Morgan some muscles. Like, you know, like little muscles? That's how we're gonna know it's Morgan, okay? I'm a little sick, so if I sound funny, that's why. All right, guys, let's draw Derek Morgan. Eyes are closed. Okay, I'm gonna draw it closer to the top this time. Okay, Morgan's head. Better? We're doing better? Now, Morgan usually wears, oh no. I don't think what I just did was correct. Oh crap, I was supposed to give him muscles, okay. Muscle, muscles, arms, and hands. This is not going well, is it? Shoot, where were his pants? Right there. Did I give him pants? I drew pants, right? I remember drawing pants. Yeah, no, I drew pants. I'm gonna give him an FBI vest too. The most sense for him. Okay, F. FBI. Are you looking at Derek Morgan? I think you are. How's Derek Morgan looking, guys? Is he good? I'm gonna look and see what we did. <laughs> I didn't draw pants. He doesn't have legs. <laughs> How did I forget? Guys, I literally forgot to draw his legs. Um, his muscles aren't attached to him, so that's good. At least his head, like his face is on his head. That's like a big step for us, guys. But the fact that he's missing legs is kind of a problem. I just drew Morgan, so let's draw JJ. What should I draw with JJ? Um, this is like early season, so I'm gonna think of her as the media liaison. So I'm gonna give her a microphone because she's telling the news things. Eyes are closed, paper is located, JJ is being drawn. Am I doing better than I did with Emily's hair? I feel like I did better than I did with Emily's hair. Eyes, eyes, nose, mouth. I feel like I missed her head. So now I'm drawing JJ, and this is gonna be her hand, and she's holding a microphone. Right? That's what she's holding. And then these are her pants with her shoes. That one like started off what felt like well, and then I feel like I went, I drew her face too low. The microphone looks good. Guys, it's JJ. Definitely looks like JJ, obviously, not just a random woman with a microphone. I was right about the face. I didn't think I was that off with her face, but yeah, it's because the hair got pushed down. And we were just kind of screwed from there on out. Next on the list is David Rossi. Oh my gosh. I don't know why, but I really just want to give David Rossi a coffee mug. Why? Because I want to. All right, guys, eyes are closed. Paper is in front of me. Here I go. Okay, so here's his head. Okay, I didn't mean to give him curly hair, but I think I just did. His eyes, his nose, his mouth. Now we gotta give him his like beard-ish kind of thing. So this is where his head is. This is where his like suit jacket is. Okay, and then the other side of his suit jacket. I don't know why I decided to do it like this. Why I thought this was a good idea. That's like the bottom of the jacket, right? Yeah, definitely. Then here's his pants and his shoes. I think I forgot to give him hands. So if this is his hands, then his coffee mug is gonna look like that. And you are now looking at David Rossi. That's not that bad, 
guys, okay, it's bad, but like, look at this. <laughs> oh my god, okay, if everything was in the right place, like this is not terrible. I don't know why his hands had to be here when they should have been here, but that's okay. I like David Rossi. I think David Rossi looks really cute, guys. I really like the way this one came out. This is probably my favorite one so far. We've got two more characters, guys, and the next one I'm gonna do is Penelope Garcia. This one's gonna be fun because I get to draw a dress. I'm gonna draw her octopus mug, the one that breaks. That's the one that breaks, right? Is that the one that breaks? Someone let me know. Her mug breaks in season 14 and JJ fixes it. Which mug is it? I thought it was the octopus one, but I could be wrong. Anyway, let's draw Penelope Garcia because I'm really excited. My eyes are closed. Here's her head. And now I'm gonna give her all her, it should be wavy, but I just did curly, because I'm an idiot. How do you draw a dress? Wow, I already know this is bad. This is so bad. Okay, her feet are gonna come out at the bottom. And she also has arms, like most people. Oh crap, did I give her a face? I didn't give her a face. So this is probably where her face goes. Right? Like, that's her face. Great. So I'm gonna draw her octopus mug over just over here. If you wanna draw an octopus mug, guys, this is all you have to do. You draw the top. And then... Ooh. Ooh. That didn't make any sense. That's her octopus mug that she uses, probably. Here she is, guys. Penelope Garcia. dress is that and what is her arm doing? I also forgot to give her glasses and now realizing. Not that that would have worked anyway. This is the scariest one yet because I feel like this is something out of Mr. Scratch or something. You know like Matthew's creepy Mr. Scratch drawings. That's what this is and I'm over it. You guys, we have one left. The one that I'm excited most for. I'm gonna draw Spencer Reed and this is like long-haired Spencer Reed so this should be interesting. Eyes are closed and we are off his head. How's it looking? Great, I know. So this is just his torso area, right? Now I'm trying to remember how to draw a vest. I guess I'll just have to do this. That's his vest. Now he's tall and lanky, so I'm gonna give him like long, lanky Spencer Reed legs. Did I give him arms and hands? I don't think I did. Okay, so I'm gonna give him a book. That's his book. Meet Spencer Reed, the smartest little genius the world ever did know. This one, if I'd gotten the hands right, would have been probably the best one because it's like all in the right general area. Just, dude. If I could have just moved the freaking hands in the right place. Honestly, not terrible, but like, could have been better. You guys know what's coming next? No, you don't, because it's only in my brain. Here we go. was really really fun for me to film. I had a lot of fun with it and I hope you guys enjoyed it too. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye!